Hey y'all, it's Commander Savannah. I'm back with Shadowrun Returns. This is now part 25. So we have infiltrated um, the base of the Telestrian area and now we made it to the elevator. We've done a lot of combat. And this is probably, after this, I'm sure we'll kind of quote unquote have a final safe house moment and then we'll do the final thing with Jessica, I'm assuming. Like I said, it has been so long, I cannot quite remember. So here we are, we're in the elevator, and let's go ahead and get continued on from where we left off. Executive Actions Crowding into a corporate elevator on a shadow run is risky. You're exposed, vulnerable, but time is of the essence. The CEO's office is 50 floors up, and the Baron has your back. In theory, light, blanderized music flows softly from hidden speakers as you make your way up to James Telestrian's office and towards your objective, a sample of Project Igis. You need to find the sample and get out before the Baron loses control of the Telestrian mainframe and all hell breaks loose. Is this gonna go sideways? So obviously, I just, okay. Actually, let me go ahead and do my umpteenth. Oh, that's right, I have karma points. I have a lot of karma points. Uh, hmm. I don't know. Here, I'm going to do a random cutback because I got to decide what I want to invest in. And I do want to go ahead and save. I always try to save after each transition or recording. Um, just in case we have an oopsie like we did the one time and I have to redo a section. So I will be right back. Okay, guys. So I'm back. I invested some of those karma points and let's get back to it. Okay, I'll be honest, I was ready for some combat. Okay. Oh, yeah, we can already tell. <laughs> mm. This globe glows with an unearthly light. The areas around Tier, Tier Gear, and Tier something. It went away before I could read it. Um, I'm sure you guys read it, though. I mean, we could go ahead and obviously interact with that, but ooh, a piano. Is this the way out? It's looking like it. I feel like we're gonna have to, after we investigate the desk here, we'll have to um, fight, maybe, probably. All right, Dodger, in you go, and we will have to protect you. Let me position everybody up. I want to know where they're going to come from, I guess, is my... Or we'll put Coyote right here. And we're going to put Jesse. Well, we'll put her right here. And we'll go ahead and end it here as, I don't know where they're coming from. All right, Dodger, let's see. So of course we're going to have our attacker. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That's okay. We'll go ahead and try him again and see if we can get a third hit. Okay. Woo. I mean, it's only two of them. I'm not so concerned right now. Got one cam. Two. And we'll pick back up. Where are they at? Mm. I see that. I don't know if it's one of those things they haven't spawned yet. I'm going to go ahead and end it because I don't see them. Okay, there we go. 
All right, Dodger. Let's get our friend out again. Well, let's move a little closer, actually, to increase the chances of us actually getting hit. Although it's a high percentage all around, so far. Uh, that's okay, that works. Straight in we'll go. Well, hello. Well, you got up close and personal, you still missed. Oh, wow, okay. Oh, wow, okay. Dodger, it's okay, I believe in you. I want them to go ahead and both be close to each other, so we'll both go on this side. Let's see if you can go ahead and get a hit in. That's okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh, you're over there. Wait, what? Okay. <laughs> Nice. Oh no, I did it again. Perfect. Alright, Coyote, I'll bring you over here by Jesse. I don't know if I can get a hit where she's at, yeah. Uh, Coyote, we're gonna move you. Oh, you have some cover. Jesse, we're gonna move you out of cover. See? Should have kept Coyote there. Whoa, you're a big one. Okay. <laughs> um. Well, that's what I get for spamming the button. Perfect. Okay, you're literally stuck over there. You guys are coming closer to us. It's so funny because it just looks like he's punching him. <laughs> Alright, almost got you. You're too far away to really do any. Aww. Well, that wasn't cool at all. Alright, Dodger, let's get closer. Um, we'll have to get that after we take out the other guy. Alright, my shield program. If you would come over yonder. I'm hoping it'll let us make one more move in here, but we might go back to everybody else. <sighs> That's okay. Um, let's see. I want Coyote. Where are they at? Ah, uh, let's... Put her in cover. And I'll let them make their moves. Jesse, same with you. Let's put you in some cover. My girl can go right here. Oh, well, darn it. I should have reloaded. Ooh, hey. Okay, Dodger. Perfect. Mm. Dad, it's all gone. The Brenners attacked last night and managed to blow the whole damn Columbia River facility to bits. I have had teams sorting through the rubble all morning and they haven't found any viable Project Igis material. The sample I sent you is all that's left. This is a mess. Lots of people dead, and the building is a total loss. Call me to discuss what you want me to do next. Tom. Well, that kind of spells trouble for us.
We still have to go and check that one area too. We all have to backtrack. Hmm. I don't know if Dodger can make a hit here. I'm gonna go ahead with Coyote. Jesse, are you able to get a hit right now? Of course not. Oh my gosh! That was impressive! We'll just go ahead and reload. Cause I don't I don't wanna move her closer. I mean we can't do anything just yet. Oh not nope. We're not gonna do that. All right, Dodger, let's get you closer. to heal my buddy but we can't risk anything happening to you know dodger obviously so he's gotta come first we can always summon another execute sorry execute another okay wow storm where I'm at right now. I'm gonna play it safe and leave my girl here. We'll reload though. Oh wait, did yeah. Just to Okay Dodger. Let's go ahead and Mr. Telestrian, in light of the recent attacks, I have relocated the only remaining sample of Project Igus to the safe in my office. The safe is hidden and the safe's lock is mechanical and thus not at risk from Matrix Decker attacks. Sincerely, Eric Silverstar, Director of Security, Telestrian Industries, Seattle office. So we've got our location now. Well done, Monami. As it happens, Eric Silverstar's office is on this very floor. About time a little good fortune came our way, eh? <laughs> Unfortunately, I do not make my own luck. <laughs> Yeah, you know, it's almost as if things are going according to plan. As you say, now to stop those elevators, I am sure there is an accessible node in the system we can access. 
Find it before you are overrun with guards. We st oh my god, we still have to. We have to go back to the one section! Let us go, my little shield program. I need to heal you. Alright. Gosh, this is like never ending. Coyote, I'm gonna leave there. Jesse, I'm gonna put over here. Huh. <laughs> well, that's a little troubling. All right, Dodger, we gotta. Darn it. That's okay. Oh, there we go. It's at least up ahead. get taken out but we should be at the end of this minus me backtracking to the one area all right let's see coyote you guys. Oh, don't do that. Go ahead and get this. Perfect. All right, that's the end of that. So now we have to go all the way and backtrack. The 
might have been the biggest this might have been the biggest matrix area we've um, encountered so far Got you down. Coyote. Mm. Oh, hold on. Dodger. Gosh, it's still one more down. Okay. There it is. So we still have to go in here real quick, just to check. This has to, this is definitely the biggest matrix area. Oh my goodness. Whew, feels limitless. All right, how close do I need to be to heal my course because it was a multi-shot I can only do so much all right, I'm gonna have to put my girl here and hope that they're just gonna hit her all right coyote let's just do a normal shot so we got one down I can't unfortunately ah hit anywhere Put her in the front here. Jesse. We might be able to get a shot in, which would be great. Okay, luckily he missed, but <sighs> cutting it close. Hmm. See, I should have just explored this one when I Ah It's alright. At this point, we cannot confidently assign a motive to Miss Celestrian's hiring of Shadowrunners to destroy the company's Columbia River facility, but there are two leading contenders. The most likely is that she is working for a rival megacore seeking a competitive advantage, but an alternative explanation is that it has something to do with her deep involvement with the Universal Brotherhood. While Celestrian Industries, of course, would never interfere with an employee's religious choices, our 2053 investigation raised concerns that Miss Celestrian's devotion to the cult-like Universal Brotherhood could represent a security risk to the company, and it is possible that this has become true. Yup. Trouble was a brewing. At least we're back to the beginning. Hooray! Perfect. 
perfect. Okay, Dodger, you can go ahead and exit. That should be all of them. I don't see any other movement around the elevators. We should be clear. Yes, please, thank you. So I don't think we should have to do... Yeah, no, 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 we're good. We're not, <laughs> we're not doing this again. Bye-bye. Hmm. I imagine we're going to exit this way. Really? Okay, never mind. We are going back the other way. But either way, I it's it's set in an office. An office. Okay. So well, that's not it. Hmm. Here we go. Yes. Your calm link trips again, and the Baron's face appears on screen. His voice is far less confident than before. Ah, uh, eh, this is new. <laughs> Things not going according to plan, Baron? Apparently, Mr. Silverstar's reputation for paranoia is well-founded. This panel is a hard-coded door control that cannot be accessed from the Matrix. It was not here yesterday. How'd the evidence stalled so fast? So what now? Someday we'll think of something. Very well. This will work, but the plan requires you, and only you, to stay the night. Yeah. What about my crew? You will find the elevator, once again under our control, goes to an empty parking garage in safety. Your hired help will be able to clear the building with ease. You, however, will be Telestrian's newest employee come sunrise. Now allow me to tell you where to go. Moana! Ay ay ay. This is taking a moment to load. I really hope this didn't mess up because that means I have, to <laughs> I have to redo all that. Oh, I'm so scared. I'm so scared. Um, oh, no, I'm so worried. That's literally over 20 minutes. No! Okay, I'm going to end this here <laughs> in, in case it doesn't load. Uh, I'll just end the part here. I might have to redo that. Oh, wow. I'm not happy. Okay. I really wanted to beat this today. This is this is a little frustrating. Um, and it's, it's not that it's hard. It's just... <sighs> okay. I'm going to have to reload because it messed up. Okay. I'm going to sit there and rush through that. And <laughs> we're doing this today. I will be back and I will see you guys next time <sighs> okay bye bye